Hi survivors, it's me Purpose and reporting. You hope you guys are doing well because what's going on in this world is not. I'm gonna make this a quick video. This is my third time trying to make the video out the phone, stop it on me. But the internet is going crazy right now. Very upset with the fact that Oprah Winfrey and the, the Rock, Dwayne The Rock Johnson, came out with a video asking regular people for money, for donations for the people out there and the victims in Maui. It's not that we don't want to help. It's that everybody's going through so much right now uh, with this recession, with this depression, with this inflation, with this devastation. Nobody can even afford to live right now, Harley. I mean, with the with the, with the the rent going up, with the gas, all this stuff, but our wages yet are still the same. People are suffering. Get these are multimillionaires and a billionaire who can do this really all on their own and really with the help of their Hollywood entertainment friends and it's just devastating they said all of this is allegedly in regards to who owns the organization they said that she owns this this organization and they they've been breaking it down on tiktok and what we don't I, what i don't understand neither is it's, it's a good it's a good thing to want to help these people but why would you guys come out to us and y'all have the resources y'all can ask y'all commanding thief Y'all all in cahoots with each other. Y'all can depend on one another instead of coming to us, asking us, and then it looks questionable. And it further makes people question them. Like, why would y'all even do something like that? You got all this land over there. You can house probably all them people over there. You know what I'm saying? What about sell that land, some of that land you got to give it to those people over there, build some tents or whatever, whatever you got to do to house these people. You have, you have the resources. You can do this. And don't get me wrong. I'm not saying that because she's a billionaire that she's obligated to do these things. I'm just saying before you go out, these people have got to not be in touch with reality, man. I don't know who they publishes are. I don't know who, you know, I know they probably got a lot of yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. People around them. Because when you come into regular people, people who don't have it right now, now, you're not realizing that we are really going through a lot. People are suicidal right now because they can't even take care of themselves and their families right now. People are losing jobs right now. You guys got millions of dollars. And if you can't do it for whatever the reasons are, you got this power. You got right hand. You got contacts and network of people who got millions and millions of dollars. Just y'all resources alone can take care of what's going on over there in that in Maui. Just y'all money alone can take care of a whole lot of different situations, man. So people are very upset about this. It's like these people have lost touch of reality. I don't get them type of vibes from Dwayne and Rock Johnson. Not saying that I get them from her, but I just don't get them from him. I know there's been a lot of bad press about her. I don't know anything about none of her situation. These people are trying to pin her with. I have nothing to do with that. I don't know. I'm just saying it, it's not a good look for a billionaire and a multimillionaire to come out and ask regular people for donations and stuff like that when y'all, when they have it like that. And right now it's not a good time. If anything, we need help. All this billions of dollars going to Ukraine and all that. And, and, and you have people right here in America that's hurting real, real bad. It's just not a good look, man. On top of everything else that people are, are, are blaming her of and saying about her. But you got all that land over there. You can build, you can either sell some of that land, give it to the people, or make some room for them to come over and house them for a couple of months. Kind of like what Dolly uh, Parton did. And Dolly Parton did this on her own. She was taking care of people for, I think, months or up to a year with her own money. And then you y'all coming out here asking us. And, you know, I just hope that they read the comments. I hope they get the back, you know, they hear the backlash of how people really feel so they can see, like, this is not the time to be doing things like that, especially when you got all that land over there. People are already looking at it questionable because your land didn't get affected at all, but you have all these regular people, all these natives, and, and they're displaced, and they've lost loved ones, and just lost things, and can't get no help. They said this these, themselves. We didn't say this. They said it themselves, that the water was off, they were barricaded in, um, they saying how the, the the alarm didn't go off. They were not warned. So I mean, like they have they in all this trouble over there, man. Y'all can help them people yourselves, you know. And I, I you know, if, and if it's going towards those people, thank God for that. But they're also saying a lot of people on TikTok and YouTube, they saying those people have direct ways of you can help families individually on your own. You know, uh, they have like their own GoFundMe pages, Venmo's, and all that there, where people can get it without. Uh, some third party organization, you know what I'm saying? Because sometimes you just don't know about these organizations. I'm not saying about hers per se. I'm just saying you just don't know. It's always better to give it to the people directly yourself if you can, if you have that direct contact. 
and resources but there's ways to find out how to get to these people directly if we can a lot of people would love to we just can't right now we're trying to figure out how we're gonna feed ourselves tomorrow most people you know it's just it's just crazy how all this stuff is unfolding and these people that got all this money they out of touch with reality i don't get them bad vibes from Dwayne the rock johnson i think that he probably was trying to do a good thing and it's just that he's with her and he's probably not realizing how people are looking at her right now and you know i probably i don't think he's probably taking away well the backlash because he's probably really doing his heart want to help you know he's a native from over there but we just never know it's just not a good look right now for multi-millionaires and a billionaire to come out and ask people for their heart or money and some of us don't even have it some of us trying to wonder how we're going to pay the rent next month or how we're going to do whatever we got to do for our own lives and our own selves next week you know it's this 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 is just not the time y'all tell me how y'all feel about it you know i don't know if y'all seen it y'all can google it the video with oprah winfrey and Dwayne the rock johnson asking people for money to go towards the uh maui victims y'all let me know in the comment section um and watch this world watch the weather smell your water boil and purify your water before you use it and keep surviving purposeand.com